everyone and welcome to our special mini concert. Today we're so excited to have Christina Johnson. Christina is an incredible coloratura soprano and her and her husband Slava are like a power couple. Um, they do these incredible broadcasts and I'm honored that Christina has chosen Classical Crossover Magazine to be her first show of the fall online. So please, we know you're going to enjoy it. Consider throughout the broadcast if you'd like to donate. We'll have different links to her PayPal. Um, you can also buy Christina's album Blessings and follow and support her on social media and Spotify. Without further ado, Christina Johnson. Hello everybody, my name is Christina Johnston and I am a coloratura soprano. I've been doing online concerts for the past year since the pandemic. Many of you I'm sure um, have been following me and thank you so much for all your previous support and support still today. The lovely Natasha from Classical Crossover magazine has asked me to do a mini concert for you today and this is my first concert back since having a break from July and I've been doing on uh, outside concerts with Russell Watson and also a few different places around Suffolk and around the UK. It's been wonderful to sing to people physically again but of course I understand that a lot of people around the world are still suffering with the pandemic and it hasn't gone away so I hope that I will be able to sing to you in your home for many more months to come. Today I have chosen some of my favourite pieces that I've done throughout this summer in my live concerts outside. Um, lots of them are musical theatre and there's uh, two pieces that are sort of more crossover and I hope you really enjoy what I've chosen. Uh, they all have really touched my heart and I hope tonight they will touch yours. So I'm going to start this evening off with Over the Rainbow from The Wizard of Oz.
Thank you so much everyone i hope you enjoyed that version of over the rainbow from the wizard of oz of course made famous by judy garland uh, the next one i'm going to do is from one of my favorite films um breakfast at tiffany's and of course with one of my favorite actresses audrey hepburn this is the beautiful moon river so i hope you are singing along with me and will enjoy this version As they always say, short and sweet, but I do love that one and I think the words are just so beautiful. So uh, we've redone our studio, um, as I'm sure in the near future I'll show you. Um, this is our first concert back with obviously Classical Crossover magazine hosting it. And next week, the 1st of October, we have decided to start our online shows again. Um, probably a lot less uh, than we did before, but it would be lovely to still sing to you in your living room if you'll have me. So the first one we're going to do is James Bond Themes, which is coinciding with the release of the new James Bond film, which comes out on the 30th of September. Um, it comes out here in the UK then. I'm not sure when it comes out in the USA, but um, I hope that you will join me next Friday on the 1st of October for a wonderful James Bond theme nights. Um, but before that, I have a few more songs to sing for you tonight. 
This is the beautiful memory from Andrew Lloyd Webber's Cats, one of my favourite songs. Um, I'm going to say that for all the songs tonight. Um, <laughs> but this has actually been voted one of the most emotional songs ever written for a musical. So I hope you enjoy it. I'm 
Thank you so much, everyone. I hope you enjoyed my version of Andrew Lloyd Webber's memory. Um, I think I was crying a little bit there, but anyway. Um, <laughs> the next one I'm going to do is a very beautiful uh, song, often sung um, at the football, actually, in the UK. Um, but it's one of my favourite songs from Carousel and uh, made famous, actually, by Rennie Fleming, who uh, is another favourite soprano of mine. Um, this version actually is Josh Groban's version, and this is the very famous and beautiful You'll Never Walk Alone.
enjoying the concert so far, I'm interrupting you to remind you that Christina and Slava are doing this incredible job, and if you would like to donate to them, you can do so at the PayPal link below. Um, we really appreciate all their efforts and whatever ways you can support them through comments, through streaming, through liking them on social media will be greatly appreciated. We do also hope that you will go ahead and subscribe to this channel. We have an upcoming concert in which Christina will be featured in again. It's called Songs of Inspiration and that will come October. So go ahead, hit subscribe. You can also follow us on Spotify where weekly we introduce new artists to you on our Discovery playlist. And without further ado, let's get back to the show. Thank you so much. Another beautiful, beautiful song from a wonderful musical. Um, I've got a big uh, love of Andrew Lloyd Webber. So uh, the next one I'm going to do is from one of his musicals that's very well known, um, but hasn't been out that many years. Um, it's Love Never Dies. And this is the main song from Love Never Dies that the Phantom has written for his love, Christine. And she performs it on stage back in the opera house um, where he is just expressing his love through this song for her.
Thank you so much, everybody. I hope you enjoyed Love Never Dies. And I'm coming to my final song of the evening. It's been an absolute pleasure to sing to you tonight. Thank you so much again for having me in your home. Thank you once again to the lovely Natasha who has invited me to sing today for Classical Crossover Magazine. And uh, I'm looking forward to singing so much more to you uh, with the year going ahead. And I'll sing you my final song. Um, it is Gloria, the Gift of Life from um, Andrea Pocelli's album. And it is really beautiful about a father singing about his daughter uh, walking her down the aisle on her wedding day. So I hope you enjoy my final song and have a wonderful rest of your Sunday. everybody and thank you again to Natasha for having me. I hope to see you all on the 1st of October on my YouTube channel, The Christina Johnston. Lots of love to you all and can't wait to perform to you again in your living room very soon. Bye! Thank you Christina, that was so gorgeous. Thank you Slava. 
Um, we so appreciated you guys being here and sharing your talents with us today. Everyone, please go ahead and support Christina. We'll have all her links available. Um, and we're excited that Christina will be coming back, as I mentioned before. October, the theme is Songs of Inspiration. And it's just some of my favorite music, Sacred, and just different songs that inspire. Um, and we have some incredible artists. We're going to have Grace Foley. We're going to have a new artist to our concert called Laura Williams. And also Alex Sharp, who was in Celtic Women and is much beloved. Um, so much wonderful music ahead. So we hope to see you there. And guys, we also have a new issue of Classical Crossover Magazine featuring Laura Breton on the cover. So if you haven't already, please go ahead and get a physical copy. These will be available on our website, classicalcrossovermagazine.us. And I want to give a shout out to our Patreons because I love doing this so much, but it is a lot of work. And having people support us means the world. Um, so thank you, Tuomo. Thank you, Patrick. Thank you, Karen, um, for showing me that you support me through this. Um, and if you guys would like to become a Patreon, you can get a subscription of the magazine, either digital or physical. There's different levels available. Um, just seeing that helps me know that <laughs> there's people that are out there enjoying what we're doing here. And um, it really means a lot, especially some days get overwhelming. So, you know, being inspired by the incredible music of these artists, um, like Christina, she's just a sweetheart. I'm so excited whenever I see anything from Christina. And having the support of the Patreons means a lot. So thanks guys for being here. And please do tell your friends about this concert, share it, and also let them know about the concert in October. We look forward to seeing you then.